Hello, what's up, awesome people? My name is Inistas, and you're welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, as you can already tell from the title, I'm in Kavali, and right now I'm heading to the lake, the Nyonyi Eco Resort. So that's where we're heading to. Come along with me. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. For the water, uh, we are doing. Uh, let me show you how my brother is struggling with that. <laughs> okay, you okay? Let me hold for you. You're cool. When was the last time you had a life jacket on? 2007. Five. Seven. Seven. I my. Okay, so that's the boat we are going to take, and that's the guy that is going to take us to the resort. So at what point of the journey do you get time to look for the whistle? <laughs> Was your boat right? That's cool. That's cool, eh? guys we are heading to what our guide has called a game what a game view yeah this is the only island on lake bunyoni where you get to see you know some animals so these are the only animals that are used with people okay so i can touch it yeah you can touch on him on her she it's... is called maria maria hi maria, maria. Wow. so you said this is maria this is maria the baby is called vivian the baby is happy. Then the father is called George. Wow. So it's a she? Yeah, it's a she. She's cute. She's warm. <laughs> so the other the other zebra that you saw is yeah. used to these donkeys. Oh, because I was wondering. And how the zebra zebra and the donkey are close friends. 
Okay. They can even crossbreed. Really? Like a zebra can crossbreed with a donkey, then they produce a zonkey. <laughs> when I get back home, I'll Google the word zonkey and see how they look like. <laughs> yeah, actually, uh, this this Maria mm. is pregnant. Oh, right but now. We, but we don't know who is the father, the father of, the child. of the child. He wow. might be a zebra or a donkey. George. Please, you guys have to call me when she gives birth. I have to be here yeah. to see the birth of a donkey. Okay, so this is Maria, the one we saw, right? Yeah, that is Maria. So this is George. So George the is other, the husband. Yeah, the other one resting is that's yeah. the baby. Yeah, baby. Wow. Baby, baby, yeah. So is George also fine with us touching him over? They are all fine. Okay. Like when you are touching on him, you don't. Uh, eh, you don't stand behind him. You can keep. Oh, so you're standing when you're standing in the front. So they always fight. We also have John, hey. but two males cannot walk with a female. Oh, okay. so they have to fight, then the loser has to disappear. And whenever George sees John, yeah, it is a must fight. Hey, he always so is John, John right now. <laughs> John is the outside, is ever near the restaurant. Oh. <laughs> So tell us about this cottage. Does that mean that if I stay in that, in that cottage, I get to have a one on one with these animals? Or... Like they patrol around every night. Oh, I don't know why I thought they are always here. Because down looks like they have been here for some time. This is where they rest from. Okay. And at times they can come and just rest here. Okay. So you can book this cottage? Yeah, you can book this cottage. This is um, a, a, a yes. really cottage. Okay, so guys, right here where we are, I don't know why I, at first I thought this is where they are always staying, but apparently they're just here resting. Uh, but this is one of the cottages right here at uh, Lake Bunyoni Eco Resort, and it's called Njuyera. Njuyera is one of the islands at Lake Bunyoni, right? Yeah, Njuyera. So you can get to stay here and have a one on one with the animals. These are not the only animals on this island, you are going to get to see more animals. And in case this is the first video that you're watching on my channel, do not forget to subscribe because I'm bringing you this and more. And both of them are males. Okay. They had brought the females, mm. two females and two males. Okay. Wow. It doesn't feel like we are on an island. It feels like a mainland. Yeah. Actually, we also have uh, one blue monkey. Oh, really? He's only one. Yeah. But we had made a report uh, for them to, to give us the the female one so that they can multiply. Yeah. Because people like the monkey. Yeah. The way he takes himself, the way we feed him, mm. the way he eats, people like him. Yeah. So this is the. This is these are the impalas. Yeah one family of impalas the females wow. with one male the male has horns then the females don't have horns okay. so whenever you see any, any with no horns that is a female are they, harmful? they are not harmful like when you try to come close of them they will run away so guys those are the impalas i'm trying to get closer to them because i've been told that when you try to get closer they run away so I'm trying to be as gentle as I can. The difference between impalas and cobs is that the these ones these ones they have black stripes as you can see behind. Mm. Then the cobs don't have. This is the second biggest island yeah, on the lake. 35 acres of land. Mm. Then the first one is Brahma. Yeah, okay. Is the one with a school and a hospital. Yes, it is 132 acres okay. of land. Then the last one is mm. Punishment Island. Yeah. And then the rest follow. <laughs> yeah, then the rest. So here is where they could, the animals could drink water from. Oh. Because they were brought when they were still young. Yeah. 
Then they were after... thing, eh? that, that is a Ugandan cob. No, like this cemented thing. Yeah, this it's for water. Eh? Yeah, this 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 hole. Yeah, is for water. They could drink from here when they were still young. Mm. They were they could be after I do, drinking from the lake. Yeah. So when they grow up, mm. now they can go to the lake for drinking water. Even the babies. Wow. Learns faster to drink from really? the lake. We no longer put water in this this hole. Wow. Yeah. So mm. black water trees are below this thing eh, to support yeah. it. So yeah, to support this. Thing. I've always wondered how they do this swimming you can dogs. Come like... and have a walk on it. So for you guys that are so good at swimming, this is a swimming dock. You can come and swim only if you trust your swimming skills. Vakuvinum, you can swim in the pool. Hmm? This is a lake, the second deepest lake in Africa. So. That is the sound of the other near emperors. Eh, hey, they are fighting with the zebra. Yeah, you can see he's going to them and he will scare them away. Oh. So where are they coming from? Where are they going? They have been scared uh, by the other one. Oh. So now they are coming here. Not this one. It's not this one. This is the isolated family. Hi babies. Okay, see brothers are so cute. My brother has never seen tents, guys. Is the honey? Yureka, how do you have a, a traveling sister and you don't know how tents look like? Okay. Yeah. Then one more. 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 So my people that love camping, I got you. And I got you. In every place I go to, I have to show you the place where you get to camp. Uh, just in case you can't maybe afford the accommodation or you just want to camp. So in my background, those are, uh, you know, this is like their camping site. Very perfect. I like the way it is like straight all the way. So you don't need to carry your own tent because the tents are here. And yeah, so you can just come and camp right here at Bunyonyi Eco Resort. How much are you camping, right? 75k per night. And you get it's bed and breakfast. It's camp and breakfast. <laughs> tent and breakfast. 
So right here we are going to get a chance to see one of our cottages right here at Bunyuni Eco Resort. So come with me, let's check it out. This cottage is called Itambira. Yeah. So when you get inside, it's a cute room. So this is a double room. Okay. It's for two people. Okay. We also have intercom. Mm. Like we use it when you need something here. Or oh, when something system. happens to you, you call at the reception. Okay. You can come come and see the shower and how the shower works. So this is the bathroom. Wow. If someone saw this room from outside, they can never tell that this is how it looks from inside. Wow, it's cute. So this, this shower has hot and cold water. But we use Tanganyika water boiling system where we heat water from outside the cottage then it enters the, the oh, cottage when it is hot. It's hot yeah. So you open the left tap, mm. you let the water flow down, mm. you keep filling water until you access the temperature you want. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So this is the What's this material? This material that is here. This. This is called organo. Organo. Like this bamboo. Oh. They get it from bamboo. Okay. So yeah. you get to hang your clothes here. Your clothes here and the bags there. Okay. Wow. This is my favorite part of it. Like, this is so authentic. It is one hundred and forty dollars. Wow! On full board. Full board. Full board. So, guys, when you stay in this room, so when you wake up on your balcony, you have the view of the lake right there, and of course, you know the hills. I mean, we're in Kabare, so definitely you have to access that. Yeah. So guys, when it gets to the evening, these guys come to chill. 